This weekend, the beaches will be packed for the Jacksonville Sea and Sky Spectacular. Yeah, this free two-day event kicks off Saturday. Today, the Marines were practicing for their amphibious landing demonstration on the beach. And this was on Blunt Island this afternoon. And then the Blue Angels were also hard at work with a number of practice runs over the beaches. And News for Jacks caught up with one of the pilots. You know, kind of as a little kid, I always dreamed of being a Blue Angel. And then more specifically, I thought being a solo pilot would be probably about the coolest thing you could possibly do. And in my opinion, I think it's the coolest job in the Navy. Uh, so I, I've, I've been pretty fortunate. Uh, so I will never take that for granted. Coolest job ever, right? One local man has also dreamed about hitching a ride with the Blue Angels. News for Jack's reporter Jennifer Reddy was there as he got this once in a lifetime thrill ride. While most people are just excited to see the Blue Angels, one local assistant principal had the chance to fly with them. We were there to capture it all. Hey, boo boo, you want to come? At Naval Station Mayport. Oh, look. What's that? Scott Stewart is suited up and buckled in tight. Now follow me, I'll give you some uh, tips on that. Getting ready to fly on a perfect, crystal clear day in Jacksonville. How's my hair? But this flight is no ordinary flight. He's flying with the elite Blue Angels. How's that? Man, watch that big nose. I got a call two days ago saying that this year I was going to get to go, and it finally happened. This is going to be your engine page here? That call came after his colleagues at Lee High School put in his name to ride with the aerobatic flight team ahead of the Sea and Sky Show this weekend. Since third grade, it's something he's always dreamed of. It's it's inexplicable. It's, uh, you know, I've, I've never been in a jet before, and now I I got to go in a Blue Angel. You ready to go flying? Let's do it. Ready, hit. During the flight, Stewart and his pilot did several maneuvers that will be performed during the air show, including the diamond roll, turning Stewart completely upside down. His kids and wife looking from the ground. Here comes the smoke. It was fast. It was intense, um, very extreme. Wow. <laughs> As the nose gets back towards the horizon, if you bend your head back, you can see the smoke of where we started. Oh, yeah. We're going to roll the jet up. I right. feel like I've been put through the ringer quite a bit. Ready, hit it. All right, there's our spike to six, and we're backing it off now. As an assistant principal, Stuart is encouraging his students, too, to follow their dreams. And what's the lesson in this for students at Lee High School after going through this experience? You just, you have no idea what the future holds for you. You really don't. He hit it. One, There's one. Two. Two. A message to work hard, remembering the sky is Relax, the limit. Cool. Figure out how you want to land the jet. I'll let you land it. <laughs> The air show starts on Saturday and runs through Sunday. The Blue Angels will perform both days. Jennifer Reddy, Channel 4, The Local Station. Well, the Jacksonville Beach Police Department wants to remind visitors about what they can't bring into the gates as well. And these include coolers, kites, balloons, drones, as well as drugs and weapons of any kind. No pets are allowed either except for certified service animals. Families, though, are encouraged to bring ear protection and parking will be extremely limited. Guests are encouraged to take advantage of the park and ride shuttle from FSCJ South Campus to Jacksonville Beach.